Hello, today I'll show you how easily it is to set up light probes for your scene. Here we have a simple scene with colored walls and an object with full 100% reflection. Let's see how it looks in Verge 3D. As you can see there's nothing reflecting on it. Let's fix this. Go to Verge 3D panel and add a simple reflection cube map light probe to the scene. We need to set the size to match the room. I'll change its type to box as it better fits the room. I'll change clipping end so it will be bigger than the room size. And place it in the middle of the room. When all done let's test it in Verge 3D. As you can see now we have a reflection of the room on the object. But the light probes also baked the object to the cube map so we can see its own reflection on it. Let's fix this. First of all, we need to create a set. I'll name it Room and put the room walls inside of it. Then we'll go to the Reflection Cube Map Preferences, and in the Visibility set, choose our new created set with the room's walls. And to exclude the room walls from influence of the cube map go to Custom Influence, and choose Room Selection set with room walls. As you can see, there's no object reflections anymore. And there is no reflection on the walls and floor. Only on the object. Now let's add reflection to the floor. First of all, I'll separate the mesh of the floor as independent object. I'll clear the history of the objects and also reset their centers. Now I can delete this and use group. Then let's add a reflection plane to the middle of the floor. Change its scale so it fits the floor surface. Change influence distance value to about 15. Let's export the scene to the engine. Yes, here we can see correct reflections of the walls and teapot on the floor surface. That's it. Thanks for watching and goodbye.